thanks a lot for joining me inside this class and inside this tutorial we are going to see how we can using the screen manager to make a uh, to make a, a to make an widget that you can swap uh, as you can see inside any smartphone so uh, as usual we will import the application so from kv dot app import app so this is will be an advanced lesson you should follow along uh, and watch all the other previous tutorials we will import the builder and from kv dot label we will import the label class we will also import the button class we will import the box layout and also we will import the screen so let's define what we have we, we have imported the label we have imported from kv.ox we have import the button we have import the box layout we have import the screen and after that we will define that we have an middle button or anything but for now because we will define in the kv and we have the fifth, fifth widget this inherits from the widget and we will define an inst constructor and it's called super and four l in letters we want to make five buttons and we want to make five screens and we want to make five labels so uh, i think if we go here and add or make an list for i will uh, type my name maybe typing so uh, after that these are the names that we will add so for all in letters so this list we will make an screen so this will be an screen and name will called be the l and inside this screen we should add an widget it's called it's it's uh, it's an label of course and the text will be also the l and after that self dot ids dot screen manager dot add widget self dot ids dot buttons dot add widget text will be so we have added a widget which is the screen the widget has five screens each five screens has a text of the each screen has only one button and this application will return the fifth widget 
and if name equals main uh, then we will run the fifth app dot run all right I think now we will start to define the layout inside the KV. So we will go here and type another file which is fifth.kv and again we will say that we have the fifth widget and inside this one we have orientation to be vertical and we have the box layout and we have the height and we have ID which is buttons and we have the screen manager ID calls SM then we have of course the button M button so on press app dot root dot IDs dot SM dot current will be self dot text so let's explain this we have an box layout which is called the button and you have the screen manager so uh, inside where is the lesson file so here inside is the so uh, each screen has only one button and if we uh, clicked on this button it will go to the screen which have the same name because we have defined the same name to be the same name so it will go to the screen which have the name uh, to be this name of the uh, button so let's go to run our application 5.by and it's called a widget isn't defined because we have to import from kv.uix.widget and I think if we using the box layout it will be much much better so I will using here the instead of widget I will using the box layout so uh, basically the box layout it's stake all the buttons to the screen so let's uh, see what we will get it's called so we have uh, missed or forget to add here the star and uh, let's to the command line and run our application to see what we have and it say super object has no attribute get attribute box layout and here is the and also here m button to be the same as here m button let's run to see if we can run and as you can see we have the same I think there is some error so there was an error here so uh, return fifth widget and Alright, uh, so I found that the, the error was inside this widget, the name of the widget wasn't correct. So make sure, make sure that the type or uh, the text matches correctly. Uh, so let's go here and run. And we will say that these are the layout. This is box layout. And each time you click on these panels, you will see that there is a screen which is swapping between these screens so i hope you enjoy this tutorial see you in the next lesson